Longshoremen Union react today uh, about the back to work legislation. It's a sad day for uh, the workers all around uh, Canada. It's a sad day for the longshoremen. And the government already know that this law is not constitutional. And we're going to challenge this law uh, in front of the tribunal. We already challenged this law uh, in front of the Organisation Internationale du Travail. The question we asked six days ago, the question was very simple. Does the employer going to left uh, or stop the, mid, the measure they, they took against the longshoremen? And if they do so, the port could be reopened in the next hour. And since six days, we have no insurance from the employer. We give you the question uh, that we wrote to the employer, and uh, we give you uh, a stupid uh, response that he said, uh, I'm going to respond to uh, the longshoremen for, uh, to the union after uh, the adoption of the law. How could we say $25 million are lost because of the stop on the Port of Montreal, and nobody uh, run against the employer to say, hey, what's your answer about the, the, the two questions of the longshoremen? And we think at the same time that it's a social responsibility for the Prime Minister of Canada, Mr. Trudeau, and for the Minister of Labor, Ms. Uh, Madame Tassi, that uh, to answer our question, they put a special law. And they put a special law who, uh, to, uh, to uh, challenge the, the, the longshoremen and reopen the port. How the man and the woman that we represent are going to return to work? What is going to be the condition of working of our member? Is it going to be for the privilege of the employer to do what he wants? Or the, or the government going to answer our question and reestablish the condition of work that we had on the 9th of April before the employer put pressure measure against the longshoremen that we represent?